welcome to my channel my name is Wolo it's a beautiful new week I want to say thank you to everyone who have subscribed to my channel and have seen my videos I love to share information about life in Canada immigrating to Canada and everything useful that I know will be beneficial to anybody and today I will be sharing information um, about um, Destination Canada it's called Destination Canada which means um, Canadian employers and the Canadian government will be visiting Paris and Brussels to recruit um, bilingual workers. So if you're a bilingual person and you are living in these areas, it's not restricted to these, um, uh, it's not restricted to people from these places. If you're, as long as you're bilingual and you can speak English and speak French, you can also register to attend. So I'll be show you shortly on the Government of Canada website where you will go to register and then once you get an invite, you'll be able to have access to job postings, you'll be able to connect with employers and then you can send in your resume and then apply and then they will also invite you to attend um, the job fair. It's more like a job fair in Paris and Brussels. So if you're living there or if you have um, a Schengen visa and you know you can attend I would say it's a very good opportunity for you to go and attend it as long as you get an invite because it's strictly by invite once you attend you are likely to get a job that will you know bring you into Canada under work permit or um, as long as you have an express entry profile you can also include that um, once you get a job offer as um, um, you can include that in your express entry profile as an arranged employment where um, you can get enough scores to get an invite um, to apply for the express entry. So I'll be showing you shortly on the website what to do and where to go and um, take advantage of this opportunity. If you know anybody, if you have any friend who is bilingual, who is living in France, who is living in Belgium, that's Brussels, and who is bilingual, like I mentioned, you don't need to live in these places as long as, as long as you're bilingual. If you're bilingual, you're living anywhere in the world and you have um, a travel visa to um, these places, you can also apply. And um, you can also register on the website and um, keep your fingers crossed. You can just get an employment and then come into Canada walking straight instead of going through the normal um, process of um, immigrating. So this is the Destination Canada Mobility Forum and they have two events coming up in Paris and Brussels on November 15th to 17th in Paris and November 19th in Brussels. And basically the government of Canada and Canadian employers will be going to these places to seek candidates um, who can come and live and work in Canada. So this is another way of immigrating to Canada for anybody who is bilingual. And if you're living in these places, if you're living in Paris, if you're living in Brussels, and when I even um, asked questions concerning this, I was told it's not limited to people who are living in these areas. As long as you're bilingual and you can travel to Paris and travel to Brussels, then you can go ahead and register um, for this event so that you can attend. The event is based on invitation only, so you have to re register on the website. And this is where you go to register. So you click on candidates, and then when you click on candidates, you can read the details here where they say that once you register, um, you will get access to job postings for this event. So when you click on candidates, you come here and you find out the details of what you need to register. So before you register, you're, you're asked to have a resume in French and English, which is in the Canadian format. I have done um, a video on Canadian resume. So for you to know how to um, get a, a Canadian resume, please check the video I did on Canadian resume. And then um, you have to identify one or two professions that is suitable and then find out your level of English and French using this tool. And then you can participate in an information session before coming. So when I click on an information session, these are the information sessions that are taking place. Some of them are online. Some of them are 
not online you have to be there to partake in the information session but it's not compulsory like you can see this one here it says online and this was done in june 18th so it's already passed but if you scroll down and um this one also was done august 13th which is already passed these are the other ones that are taking place but these ones between september and october they are not online you have to register and attend if you can if you don't if you can't register and attend it's not compulsory um but it's one of the things that um it's not really a requirement it's just for you to know what it is about coming to canada the fifth one says if you can't attend the mobility forum in paris or brussels you can consult the public employment services website in your country of residence to view job offers that may be of interest to you so another important information that you also need to know before you register is that um, your profile will be accessed by the public employment service to match your skills and experience with employers and then you should also have already have an express entry profile and then you already have a working holiday permit or you meet the eligibility requirements for immigration to canada outside quebec basically if you have an express entry profile then you are good to register so you just click here register and ask to participate then for um the employers that will be attending the information session to recruit people to come to canada to work this is where you get the information for the employers that will be attending the forum and they are employers in the following sectors in information technology multimedia marketing and communications finance hospitality culinary and food industries translation aeronautics and avionics construction so if you know that you your occupation falls in any of these categories um i i would suggest that you go ahead and register but you have to be bilingual it doesn't matter where you live anywhere you live in the world as long as you're bilingual you can register and um once you get an invite to attend try as much as possible to attend because you will be connecting directly with employers and you will get a job directly from employers that will give you work permit and you will come to canada directly um so below you can also find the information there's a candidate who will be ready to leave for canada with an open work permit that means they can go to canada immediately and start working from the day they arrive you don't need to do any other steps related to immigration other candidates who will be eligible for a work permit um the occupations and the skill levels are there so uh, apparently you just get a, a work permit without having to get get a labor market impact assessment so this information i'll be leaving the link at the end of this video on the description box of this video for you to um register thank you so much for watching and have a good day bye bye